How are you beautiful people doing? It is I, the task at hand, and I am back at it again. And this is a very special video because, yes, as you've seen by the thumbnail, it is story time with task. And it is, it's a very good story because this, like, it's, it's amazing. It's crazy. It's out of this world. I was absolutely, um... I was so excited to tell this, and I've been wanting to, you know, record, um, to record, like, my commentary over some crazy gameplay. By the way, this gameplay, I, I'm not gonna tell you how many kills I'll drop, you'll see at the end, but I absolutely, I, um, hmm, what's the word? I schmongdoable these kids? Yeah, I think that's a vocab word. I don't even know, but, yeah, this story is absolutely insane. I was at my job, Taco Bell, you know, just a regular old day. Just straight chilling, you know. Um, I was doing the cash register in front, so you know, taking people's orders face to face and all that shit. And um, yeah, yeah, it was just real. It, it was just normal, you know. Nothing. No one was crazy or anything like that. And I was have like, I was like, hey, I'm kind of bummed out. I gotta work here, cause dude, listen to me. If you're watching this, man, fast food is the worst. Do not get a fast food job for your first job or any other job. If you have other options go for the other options don't like make fast food your last resort because trust me it, it's just you just don't want to go through the shit but um besides that though right i just finished taking somebody else's order you know and all that um no i actually just finished passing their food out and you know the guy i said oh have a nice day sir and this guy walked out the store and then out of nowhere i'm just chilling <laughs> again you know what i'm saying i'm trying to like I'm just trying to get the day over. I'm trying to like, hurry all this shit up because I'm like, eh, I don't really want to be here. Um, <laughs> it sucks, but hey, that's the truth. And um, and this guy comes in. He's like six three, maybe, or he he's just taller than me. And I'm like, what the fuck? And you know, I'm six feet. If you guys don't know, I'm six feet, so I'm like, I'm I'm pretty tall. But he was way taller. You know what I'm saying? Well, six three is pretty tall. I'm tall, but not pretty fucking tall. This dude was fucking, he was giant. And then I looked at him. I'm like, all right, um, welcome to KFC and Taco Bell. How can I help you? You know, that's, you know what I'm saying? That's like the slang. Not even slang. That's what you're supposed to say, when, you know, when you greet a customer and all that crap. And, you know, I was taking it normally, and I'm like, and he was like, oh, can I get a chalupa beef or whatever, or a chalupa with beef? And then I'm like, oh, wait, what the? I'm like, I'm like yeah, wait, yeah, you can, sir, you can. And then out of nowhere, I look at him, and I see his face, and I'm like, wait. Jonah Lucas, I say that to him, and he's like, he's like, yo, what's up, man? And I'm like, yo, ah, like, dude, listen, listen, I've never been starstruck before, but just, I don't know, I, cause I, he's famous, right? He comes from my city, Worcester, cause you know, that's where, I, that's where I live, and, um, he actually, he comes from my city, and he's a famous rapper, he's been getting a lot of, um, What's it called? A lot of notoriety around here and just all over the place. And he's really talented. I'll put his link. I'll put a link down to all his music or his channel where he uploads it down in the description below. You guys should definitely check him out. He's crazy. He's re he's really he's just really talented. If you give him a chance, you know, um, just listen to him. He it's really good. But I was absolute. I was just starstruck because I never been in somebody in front of somebody that famous. Or, um, yeah, um, from my city. Like, I just thought it was insane. And I'm like, yo, dude, like, there's no way I'm serving you right now. He's like, oh, yo, you listen to my music? I'm like, yeah, man, you're the shit. He was like, yo, thank you. And then I take his order, just like, like, I take his, nor um, I take his order just like, you know, any other person or whatever. Um, and then <laughs> I'm just like, <laughs> but I was like smiling the entire time because I'm like, dude, no way, it's Joan or Lucas. And yeah, um, yeah, I took his order and I gave him his food and all that. And I'm, uh, we, uh, oh yeah, he asked for a drink. And he was like, yo, can I get some lemonade? I'm like, dude, man, you 100% can get some lemonade. And I was like hyped to get it, like to give it to him or whatever. And then I went over because the lemonade is in the back. Um, it's not in the front of the store where you can get the drinks. So I went and I'm like, oh fuck, we ran out. And I'm like, dude, there's no way we ran out. Jonah Lucas is asking for a lemonade. And then, um, I went back and I'm like, yo, my dude, we don't got no lemonade. He was like, damn. And I'm like, yeah, I know, I'm sorry. And I felt bad. I'm like, dude, fuck. <laughs> I wanted to get, like, I felt like I knew him. You know, like, even though i never met him before I, I don't know i just felt like i knew him like he was a cool person and all that shit before i even met him but um but yeah like just meeting him and all that shit it, it was really cool 
Cause he was he was nice. He was chill. He didn't like he didn't seem like an ass about it. He was just like ah, oh, it's all right, man. And I'm like okay, thank you. And I told him I'm like yo, keep doing. I had to say I'm like yo, keep doing your shit, man. You're absolutely talented. Like don't stop doing it. Like the fact that like you put that much effort into your music, I really respect it. He's like yo, thanks for saying that, bro. Much love, man. I'm like all right, yo, you have a great day. He was like all right, and then you know <laughs> we had like a little bro moment. I was like yo, peace out. Like you're the man, and um, yeah, man, it it was crazy. Oh, I'll put a um. What's it called? On the thumbnail, I also put a picture of me and him, like, so you guys don't think I'm bullshitting you. Dude, um, it's crazy, man. I don't know. I was, I was mad hyped the entire day. No matter what happened, I was just hyped as fuck. It, it was, it was definitely an awesome moment that I'm gonna remember. And the next thing, that's right, there's two different stories in the same episode. I'm telling you, it's a special episode. That was, um, the first one was about me meeting Jonah Lucas. And then, um, the second one is about, um, <laughs> these drunk-ass people, right? So, KFC and Taco Bell, the place I work at, it's next to a bar. It's named, the bar is named Mahoney's. And, um, you already know how it is, you know, people get drunk as fuck and they don't care, they drive home and all that, which is absolutely dangerous, I do not support that. Don't drink and drive. If you're gonna go out drinking with your friends, have somebody to be the dedicated driver. I'm never in that situation. I don't want to put myself into that situation. I think it just even if your person, like um, even whoever your driver is, if they like, even when they're drunk, they're not like they don't let it. They know how to hold their own or whatever. Fuck that shit. Anything can happen, man. You're drunk. You're not. Your senses aren't as sharp as they are when you're sober. So fuck that. Don't ever drink and drive. People did come, they were all drunk and shit, there was like a couple girls, a couple guys, they ordered a bunch of shit, so I told them to pull up, because it took a while to make, and when I went out there, and I could tell they were drunk, because they were mumbling their words, like, oh, we ordered this and that, but we didn't get it, so I was just like, alright, um, alright, give us one minute, and we'll have that shit ready for you, it was three crunch wraps, and I'm like, I'll put it in the computer, and then we'll make that shit, charge you for it, and it'll be really quick. Hey, just give me a minute and then come back in line. And then they waited way too long because they were fucked up. They didn't even know, like, when to come in. <laughs> but they did come in, but it was really late, so they, it took a while. And, um, you know, we had the food ready and all that shit. And the guy kept telling me before I went back in the store, he was like, stay lifted, bro. And I'm like, what the fuck? I don't smoke, but I guess he thought I did. Because whenever I laugh, my eyes get red. I don't know, that's me. You're going to have to deal with it, man. I don't fucking know. It's just weird. Anyway. But yeah, and when they came back in line, there were people behind them, and they were literally, you should have heard it, they were fucking screaming at each other, like, I don't know, they were both drunk, like, people in the car behind them and them, they were just all drunk, and they were just fucking yelling at each other in the drive-thru, so I'm like, what the hell is going on here, and, um, I don't know, they were just yelling a bunch of shit, we didn't know how to take their fucking order, but we ended up doing it somehow. And they came to the window, and this girl literally got out, peeked out of her sunroof, and was like, okay, you guys need to stop, like, stop being immature, and I'm just like, what the fuck, I don't know, crazy drunk people be coming through, and, um, yeah, we gave them their food, and they went on, and then the car behind them that was yelling, it was like, yo, those girls are like they're bitches blah 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 but they look good though and they were drunk too so i'm like okay what the fuck is happening tonight i <laughs> me honestly i didn't know what the fuck was going on that night everybody was all fucked up i'm sitting here dying because i didn't know what the hell they wanted and we un uh, we just wasted mad time laughing and they told us what they want at the window and all that shit we made it charged them passed it out pretty sure i don't know where the fuck they ended up but they got home hopefully they eating that food enjoying that shit they won't remember doing this the next day because you know they were fucked up but i don't know it was a weird ass night it was it was crazy as fuck it was very good in the daytime and I, that day was absolutely blessed for me because i met you know Jonah lucas but then it just got really weird and really funny i wasn't mad i wasn't stressed i was just happy as fuck but yeah, man, um, yo, look at this gameplay, though, I know, <laughs> I don't know if you've been watching it, but your boy right here, the task, you know what I'm saying, 
He be going off and shit. Look at look at my end score. I dropped the motherfucking 70 bomb. That's the end of the video, guys. <laughs> if you enjoyed it, leave a like. If you really fucking enjoy it, I leave my favorite. And if you really fuck with me, you know what you gotta motherfucking do. People who don't, people who are new, you gotta motherfucking subscribe to become part of the motherfucking task force. This is your man with a plan, the task at hand, and I am out.